Are you struggling with how to perfect your beauty shots or elevate your portrait game? Perhaps you've captured stunning images for a client, but you are hesitating about retouching their skin too heavily. Well, I'm here for you. Hey there, lovely people. Welcome back to my channel. It's always a pleasure to have you here. Today, I'm diving into the art of retouching beauty photos. Now, there are countless techniques out there, but I'm here to walk you through my process. Feel free to cherry pick the methods that resonate with you and blend them uh, into your workflow. Remember, the ultimate goal is achieving remarkable results. Oh, and yes, the quick heads up. Different regions, different countries have different preferences when it comes to retouching. Here in Paris, we lean towards a more natural aesthetics where the skin still shines through. So don't forget to adapt as needed to meet your client's expectation. All right, let's jump right in. First things first, let's address those pesky pimples and any other visible imperfections. I typically start by creating new layers and using the healing brush tool. It's a straightforward process and I will breeze through it quickly since it's a fundamental step that most of you are li likely familiar with. Now, let's talk about dodge and burn. My love-hate relationship with this technique is real. While it's the holy grail for skin retouching, it can also be time-consuming. Here's the lowdown on how to execute it. You will be working with curves layers, lighter and darker one. I will demonstrate uh, the process for you. It's crucial um, to differ differentiate between global skin adjustment and macro dodge and burn for pores. And here is a pro tip, use a, help, a helper layer, especially at the beginning when you are starting. The best is black and white and it's expedited uh, the process. Also prepare your actions in advance and you will save yourself heaps of time. Essentially, it's derived from traditional darkroom practices, where you brighten uh, dark areas, it's dodge, and darkening bright areas, it's burn. And it's to achieve smoother Okay, and there you have it. With practice, you will become more proficient and efficient. I hope you find this video helpful. Don't forget to hit the, that subscribe button and give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Thanks for turning in, folks. Until next time, keep snapping and enhancing those beauty shots. A bientôt!